beautiful people. Welcome to the Be Smart Po channel. Today we are doing a product review. I'll wait till this airplane decides to What's up you guys? Today I am doing a product review of the Motherload box. Now first and foremost, I want to say thank you so much rockmybirth.com for sending me one of these special boxes. As you guys know, <gasps> baby K is on his way. I am on my 34th week right now. <laughs> I'm not 100% certain where the time decided to go and why he decided to get so big so quickly, but we're here now. So I have approximately six weeks, six, seven weeks left before this baby is expected to pop out of my uterus, before I'm expected to give birth. I know that I say this a lot, but I am so excited. I'm finally going to be able to hold my son in my arms. I'm not too far now from being able to raise my baby and to love and to care for a tiny little human who decided to bless me with his spirit. <laughs> I just want to say thank you for all of the love, the support from ordering for my Amazon registry for Baby K, which by the way, <laughs> the link is down below. <laughs> If you wanted to order from the registry, just, you know, just, I'm just throwing that out there. I received this from rockmybirth.com. This is the motherload box. This is the only birth kit designed to help you prep for the push. And I'm so, so, so grateful to have connected with this mom who creates this for people. It's all to help you prep for your, your birthing experience. And I just think it's so powerful. And you know it's black owned, honey. <laughs> Honestly, I'm so excited to dig into this box and see what goodies are waiting for me inside. So let's get to it. And you know what's really cool is the story of this mama. Her first birth was actually a C-section. So for those of you that don't know what a C-section or cesarean section is, basically it's when instead of delivering your baby vaginally, they cut you open. Um, <laughs> sounds kind of painful, right? No, you are given a local anesthetic um, so that you're not feeling when they're slicing into your body. <laughs> so they give you this cesarean section for different reasons. Sometimes there's like medical emergencies where they have to go in and get the baby. Like if the baby is breech, which means like they're upside down, or if maybe their umbilical cord is wrapped around their neck, like just um, a lot of the times for emergencies, but sometimes mom just don't want to have to deliver vaginally. However, when this beautiful mama found out that she was expecting her second bundle of joy, she decided that she was going to look a little bit more into the options available to her, which unbeknownst to her were options like a VBAC which is a vaginal birth after cesarean. So it is a common misconception that after you have a C-section, that the next time you give birth, you have to do another C-section. And that's completely untrue. And now you do definitely wanna do some research on your options. Check with your physician, see what they say, what they suggest for you. But this mama, so like, what she decided to do was just get all the information. And she she grew her own birthing portfolio, you know, so that when the time did arrive, she was prepared with all the facts, all the knowledge, all the love and the brain and the good stuff. And so with this preparation of different products and research and knowledge, she rocked her VBAC. Her second birthing experience was like, it was amazing for her. And so she kind of set out to do the same thing for other moms. And I just think like, that's so beautiful to like wanna educate, but also to kind of gift and to help other mamas get through their birthing experience. And thus, the Motherload Box was created. 
Thank you for your purchase. Congratulations from us here at the Motherload Box. We hope that you enjoy all the custom items we have put together in our labor and delivery box. Please come back and visit us at rockmybirth.com. so sweet. Okay, so. Oh my gosh. Okay, so included in this, this is already so freaking cool. Like, so this info card says, congratulations. Um, your journey from maidenhood to motherhood is about to begin. Here is a quick reference of the contents you will find in your L&D kit, each with a brief description of how it will help you achieve your ultimate birth experience. Okay, so there's lots of different things in here like the preparation pamphlet, the visual birth plan, aromatherapy inhaler, honey sticks, lip balm, a delivery set, nip dip for your, when your nipples get cracked and dry and shit. That's what this card is. Beautiful design beautiful print and it's like it's just really thoughtful like wow so here's a little uh like a printed door handle sign it says welcome bringing baby earth side informed decisions will be made here respect our sacred space take a moment to review our birth plan healing begins with skin to skin i love that like it's just like those nice little touches that like really make the experience oh my gosh Oh my gosh, okay, so, oh my gosh, it opens! <laughs> so included right here are your hospital bag must-haves. It's like all in this like super handy dandy pamphlet. It has all the information in one, like that is so, that's so dope. Okay, so hospital bag must-have, must so it has um, stuff for mommy, stuff for baby, and then like extra stuff. So on this second page, there's like the stages of labor, right? She included the stages of labor. So it has like your first, second, and third where you begin with like the onset of true labor. Oh my gosh, Latin, active, and transition. She t tells you like approximately how many centimeters you are dilated. Are you freaking seeing this right now? 50 foods that help to boost your breast milk supply. There's like a resource guide where you can show like the visitor that came and the gifts that they brought for you so you can write it down and help you like keep track of your thank you notes and stuff. And then this is for the baby's first night. This is like already overwhelming and I'm just on a pamphlet y'all. Like the amount of time, the amount of time and love and preparation to go into something like this like that's so beautiful that's so freaking beautiful so this is like a visual birth plan card so that you can kind of mark off what you feeling what you're not feeling so if you want the lights dim or if you want immediate immediate skin to skin explain all procedures placenta to be saved etc etc and she has a an info guide in here about postpartum depression PPD and it is the most common problem associated with childbirth so PPD is a serious mental health problem characterized by a prolonged period of emotional disturbance occurring at the time of a major life change that is your baby so I have actually been in kind of what I thought at first to just be a creative funk um, but more recently I've been looking a little bit deeper into PPD and I am not postpartum yet you know baby K is still in my stomach but so I've been feeling kind of like um, kind of like I'm not worthy to be his mom and really guilty because I feel like I'm bringing him into a situation of course that he didn't he didn't really choose and it's not that I'm living like I don't know like I mean I have a good life I'm going to provide him with the best life that I absolutely can but I am 21 years old 
you know, I'm super young, I'm still in school, I'm a broke college student, you feel me? So, you know, like I'm working two, three jobs to try to support myself. Um, Neek is also working hella jobs to support me and the baby and him and our family and our pup. And so, you know, and I mean, I feel, I feel like that's kind of normal to like feel that, but at the same time, like it stopped me completely like a few days ago. Like I was just out. I had a full day of just nothing to do, but of course, like I had everything to do, you know, I could be editing videos or working on my business plan and all that stuff, but I was literally stuck on the couch. It felt like my body had a magnet inside of it and I was like sticking to the couch and I couldn't get up. And just these thoughts kept running through my brain like you're not good enough and you know all of that is pointless anyway. You're not going to get anywhere and your baby deserves better than you and it was kind of crazy like it all kind of hit me at once and so I just kind of gave up that day like and then like I find myself um some nights tossing and turning throughout the night nightmares of me not being able to fully take care of my child and like crying like legit bawling my eyes out trying to go to sleep and it's just like so i guess what i'm saying is already i'm experiencing the effects of postpartum depression and i'm definitely going to have to look into getting some getting some counseling or just something a, that, that a little bit more than the meditation and the yoga and stuff that i already do just to kind of help me get through it because that has been like really hurting my spirit i feel like and so the fact that this is in here though to really help you prepare is just kind and the fact that I was chosen as a representative of this brand you know to kind of showcase these things to you like I already know that all of this stuff is really gonna help me and I just appreciate her so much for creating something like this for the women of the world to experience and to help rock their birth, you know? Okay, oh my god, this is so cute. So, this is a tea infuser. It's a heart-shaped tea infuser. Oh my god. And so it's attached to a birth cloth, or not a birth cloth, a burp cloth for the baby. This right here, is a vial mother's milk tea it's a tea with intention has different ingredients in it like raspberry leaf lemon balm fennel seed etc etc so you can brew the tea inside of that heart shaped infuser you put a teaspoon in you steep it for three minutes and it makes like five to six cups all right so it's pretty freaking dope. Alright, so this is a custom made tea mug that was included. Oh, that's so cute. Tea first, then nurse. So with the mother's milk tea that you're going to be making, you can steep it inside of this cute mug that she included inside of the box. Which, by the way, you know, go follow Daily Tea Things on Instagram. <laughs> that's a little tea page, so, you know. I'm gonna be using that on there too. Also included in the box is a healing belly balm or a postpartum belly balm. Um, it's a completely organic balm formulated specifically for stretch marks, toning of the uterus, and skin restoration pre and post pregnancy. So it has in here organic shea butter, cocoa butter, coconut oil, avocado oil, jojoba, etc. etc. Like, really nice and I actually want to smell this because it's going on my skin I guess and see the consistency and texture of everything 
This smells amazing. Okay, so I'm gonna include some pictures like right here of what my stretch marks are kind of looking like right now. Um, I don't have too many, but they're there. They're starting to form and I don't know. It's like in one breath, it's kind of cool because it's like I'm carrying this tiny human, but then it's like in another breath, I'm like, I also model and I perform and all that stuff. Not that stretch marks really stop that, but they can just be like one of those things, you know? And so I'm really excited to use this and maybe post like before and after pictures like in a long run kind of thing. So that's really freaking cool. So this is the Let Down Collection System. Um, it's for collecting your breast milk when you're nursing on one side, but then the other breast is still like, of course, producing your breast milk. So what this does is instead of just nursing pads, it kind of suctions to your breast like this and it collects the milk while your baby's nursing. That way you're saving the milk instead of just kind of letting it go to waste. And I'm kind of nervous about the whole breastfeeding thing too, just cause everybody who breastfeeds basically says like it's super exhausting and like they sometimes they don't make enough milk for their baby. And so this is just really cool because now I know that I'm not, like none of it's going to waste. Now this is from Momoko Therapeutics. Momoko? Momoko Therapeutics, one of the two. And so it's handmade, organic, and vegan aromatherapy products for health and wellness. So it came in this cute little satchel. And this is a second wind aromatherapy inhaler for labor and birth. So you use this during your labor to calm and energize. You insert the inhaler into your, na <laughs> into your nostril and take several deep and rhythmic breaths. You hold and then exhale slowly. So kind of like one of those kind of things, I guess. You hold it like this or like this, one of the two. But you can use it while you're giving birth, right? It's for your labor so that it's giving you that aromatherapy that you may need to focus on like when you're giving the birth and so your mind is not on hospital room smells but on loveliness and happiness. This is the nourishing <laughs> nipple balm. So it has organic shea butter, coconut oil, calendula infused olive oil, beeswax, and vitamin E. And so it's a nipple balm, you know? So as you're breastfeeding and as you continue to breastfeed, your nipples can become dry, cracked, and like, ugh. So what the nipple balm does is it brings those nourishment back to your nipples so you're not walking around feeling like, it. <laughs> feeling like a crusty cow or something, you feel me? And I kind of want to start using it now, that way my body gets used to it. And then it can continue afterwards too. This is a hydrating lip balm that's in here and pretty self-explanatory. Mmm, smells nice. Feels nice too. Okay, so also included are some honey sticks and these are just kind of like, they kind of are like a light snack that can provide an instant energy boost for a laboring mother. So like, if I'm feeling like, let's say I'm six hours into labor or something, right? And I need like a quick pick me up or, you know, it's just all natural honey. You just suck on the honey stick, get that boost of energy back, some sugar. So I might actually steal one of these for before just because I like honey. The honey sticks are cool. <laughs> so this is a little onesie that was included in the set. It says mama did that. <laughs> It's from newborn up to 13 pounds. And so the last thing that's in this box is actually a part of the Mama Did That set. These are actually together as the Mommy and Me delivery set. So it's like a positive affirmation gown, birthing gown. Of course we have the Mama Did That onesie. And then this is a birthing gown. And it says, I got this in it. Why is that so cute? And then it has buttons on the front so that you can unsnap them and then you can nurse your baby. Like right after you give birth, 
That's so cute. So like that's for when I give birth so I can wear this. <laughs> Isn't that freaking cute? Like to wear it? Yeah. And so I just wear it, it's soft and then it, it unsnaps right here so that I can feed the baby. Snap it back up when I need to go and rest again. That's cute. Anyways. I'm in love with this box right now. The mother load box is like First of all, one of the coolest things I have ever received. Second of all, it's one of the most thoughtful things I feel like has been created, especially for mamas that are going through, you know, the pre-birth, then the labor and delivery, and then also postpartum care. So she really took the time to think about everything that you're gonna need through just throughout your entire birthing experience. And so if you go to rockmybirth.com, you can actually find all of this stuff and a little bit more on the website. Like if you wanted to order just the lip balm or just the nipple butter, just the gowns, like as a set, you can do that. But then of course, you can also get the entire mother load labor and delivery box, which comes with all of this cool stuff in here. If you, if you pregnant, if you're expecting to get pregnant, if you're going through your postpartum or any, I, I would definitely suggest looking at this site and ordering a box or if you have friends or family that are about to deliver, like, well, everything in here is so beautiful. So I want to thank the Mother Load Box so much for sponsoring this video. So you can find them on Facebook, on like just across the different social medias if you search for the Mother Load Box. But on Instagram specifically, they're at the underscore mo underscore bo. You can also just go to their website, www.rockmybirth.com. And you can also check out their Facebook page at the Mother Load Box as well. So this has just been like first of all a great experience like opening this package and receiving all of this stuff but then also I'm definitely going to be using like everything that's in here. I just thank this company so much because I really feel like it's going to help me prep for the push and then also to just have a really powerful birthing experience. You'll see this box popping up in like a few of my vlogs of course on <laughs> experience on demand or my youtube channel for the shortened versions um for mara's way day by day so make sure if you haven't subscribed to my show yet that you do so thank you guys for watching this video thank you to the mother load box for sponsoring this video and sending this amazing gift set to all you mamas out there just Keep pushing. It gets tough sometimes, but you got this. It's all a process. Just continue to radiate love, light, positivity, and success. Stay blessed and never stressed. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye!